Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we find ourselves in Elizabeth Township where we find Denver Metro audits and Sweet Tea auditing a town hall and getting into an argument with the local judge. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. What? Just recording. Can't hear you. What are you doing? I'm Judge White. I'm just wondering why you're filming other judges' cars. Oh. Hello. Is that a problem or? No, I'm just curious. Okay. No, we're just checking stuff, checking your town out. Oh, I'm fine. I'm you, watching you. You said your name's Judge Fu? I'm Judge Vincent White. I'm the town. I'm town judge. Oh, okay. Yeah. I didn't I'm one of the judges name. here. Okay. I'm sorry, sir. What was your name? Judge White? I've already said it twice to you. I'm Judge Vincent White. I'm just watching what you guys are doing, filming other people's cars in the parking lot. Is that a problem? I'm just watching, just like you're filming me. Okay. It's free. But I feel like you're getting kind of like no, with an no, attitude no, no, about no. it. Just watching. He's barely said anything to you at all. And you're already accusing him of having an attitude problem. So I'm going to go with a case of projection on your part, sweet tea. Can I ask you your names? No? Okay. This is First Amendment auditors, Judge. I, I know. Yeah. They're, going they, to they, they're, they're totally allowed to do it. I've even given my name. Yeah. But they won't give me their names. Nah. That's okay. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, what is your name? I'm Patrick Davidson. I'm the town administrator. Nice. I saw you were in. Yeah. Ah, uh, town administrator, definitely a politician, and this guy is going to bend over backwards for them, trying not to cause a problem. But, as you can see in a few minutes, DMA is going to go over to the judge and start an issue. Don't have a lot of open spot to show you, but... Yeah, we noticed that. The lobby's pretty small. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's a little tough. But no, we were just checking out whoever's car that one is because it's so cool. Looks like a race car. I've seen that brand before, but I'm not sure. I don't have any idea what it is. Is that one yours? No. Um, I, I guess I have the freedom to not answer any more yeah. questions. No, right. that's, that's, that's fine. Yeah. So please don't ask me any questions. You know, man. We don't really appreciate your attitude. This uh, gentleman came attitude. out cool, I just, I, but you're I being a little you. bit condescending and name, you're being confrontational, what is, what is sir. What you came out name? here confrontational from the beginning. What is your name? I'm me. Oh, you're me. Okay. Yeah. Well, see, I don't appreciate She's her. Attitude. She's her. I, mean, I didn't have an attitude. You, you actually approached us. I, I told he approached you. He hasn't even moved from that spot from since the very beginning. And you're the one who started off confrontational, not him. But of course your fans are going to be you over him because you're so trustworthy. Do who I am? I've asked you why you were filming but you, private Yeah, because car because you're you know. work for the this town of Elizabeth, That's right? right. I just so told you so you're a public employee. Calm That's down. Right. Bring it down I'm a little not, bit, man. I'm not upset about anything. I'm just in there watching you guys. You're telling me I'm being aggressive. I'm not. I'm watching you. Okay. <laughs> I mean, am I not allowed to watch you? Well, you're absolutely allowed to watch okay. me. It's just, I mean, you're you not doing anything. You're not doing anything illegal. I'm just saying I, I, what you're I doing is you you're, you're being a little bit confrontational no, the way no, that you no. approached us. I, I, yeah, you're approaching me. I've, 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 I have not even moved. I'm fine. Okay. Um, you have a a legitimate constitutional right to to video in public, to take pictures in public, to do all of those things. Um, and in fact, that's that's a means of the checks and balances that you have on, on our society. Generally, what I see is um, small communities that don't do it right. I see large communities that are so concerned with security that they stop they, they don't stop and think what their role is what their job is um, but I think uh, you know you got to also understand a little bit we live in a world where cameras in somebody's face is, is uncomfortable and sometimes it's I've seen, seen as an insult several cameras over here yeah it gets inside. both ways right exactly, exactly. Um, and we don't, those I don't are, stick my camera in people's faces. No, some do though, and I you know, know this. You know this. Mm, if you've been doing this any Not very point, many. I, I don't see that very often. 
usually I see people say nobody likes a camera shoved in their face. Like, oh, well, obviously we're like six, seven feet apart. Yeah. We don't, we don't shove cameras in people's faces, but no, you I mean, don't. we do what we you do. Don't. And I, yeah. I appreciate the politeness and I appreciate the dialogue. Yeah. It's, we it's, appreciate the dialogue. Well, it's important. Mm -hmm. It's important both ways. Is it something we see very often here? Absolutely not. Really? Which, which means one of two things. Either you need to do it more so we get more comfortable with it, but also recognize that it's unusual. And unusual sometimes in a small town causes concerns. Right or wrong, not, not passing judgment one or the other. Right. Really one of making sure that those rights are, are upheld. First of all, typical politician, he knows that some of his constituents may be watching him, so he's going to try to appease everybody. Second of all, Notice how DMA decides to ignore him because he's not getting any confrontation out of him. He's going to be going to the judge here in just a second and attacking him directly. He's just got to have those clicks and views. I know whose car that is, and when I see you guys approach a car that I know that's not yours, I'm going to ask that question of like why you guys are approaching that car. Not because of anything else, you have a right to, but I'm just wondering why you're approaching a car that's not yours. You understand that, right? I think that's a reasonable question, correct? I guess not yeah. really. I mean, I mean, well, people walk. People you... walk by cars all the time. They're no, parked in a parking were, lot. When you were, you were uh, within an inch away of a person's car, who I know is not to be yours, I'm going to ask you a question. I think it's reasonable. If you don't give me an answer, I'm going to ask you that question. That's it. of course that is a perfectly reasonable thing to do, but DMA is not one of those perfectly reasonable people that would understand. Okay. All right. I mean, you can, we can ask. Agree, we can agree to disagree. Well, not really dis we're not really disagreeing. I mean, you can ask. It's fine. That's right. I, I, well, I like to say, like a pu public citizen, I have a right to ask you, especially when I know yeah. that you're next to a car. I don't know how it's your brain. But I know that it's not yours. So you're the municipal judge, you said? Uh, municipal judge? What is your name? You already asked me that. Okay, my, and not, well, I'll refuse to answer your question okay. like you refuse to answer mine. Uh, see, <laughs> see, but, but see how you're a, I'm a no. private citizen and you're a public yeah. servant. You see the difference? I've already identified myself. Oh man, you really gotta hate that public servant garbage coming out of his mouth. Just because he is a judge doesn't mean he's going to be at your every beck and call. In fact, if you get convicted of a crime, this guy is going to be a guy that's going to sentence you to the penalty. So you might want to think about how you treat him. So two times to you. I, 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 I know. Just, okay, I, was just re, I was just asking. The reason I was asking again, I know you're the municipal judge. I was wondering if you get a lot of... Uh, tickets do people get a lot of tickets or at all any tickets for like a dark window tint like have you ever given someone a have you ever gave someone a fine for having too dark window tint as a municipal judge no okay i hope not I'm just wondering because you know your your tent's illegal, so that's all. Not that I think having illegal tent or dark tent's a bad thing. It's just that people can get you know money stolen from them for having too dark a tent. So I just want to make sure that you're not out there finding people for illegal tent when your vehicle's illegally tinted. That's all. That's right, Judge. Just ignore him. You know what he wants. He wants that conflict. He wants those clicks and views. So good on you. But he's going to continue to try to do this to you, to drive the stake deeper into your heart.
So you guys can tell this guy's body language is just, he's, he came out watching. confrontational in the beginning. He just can't stand that we're here, you know? I have no problem that you're here. You have every right to be here. I have and no just, problem that you're I know that you're, that you're and, saying that, you but know, it's the way you came out. I came very, out because you were approaching a private party citizen car yeah, like but you that's were not illegal. in an attempt to look like you were co potentially committing some action against a private party's vehicle. Once it was established you weren't, I was just observing like you're observing. Okay. Is that okay? It's okay. I mean, Thank like you. I said, you're not committing a crime. It's no. just the way that you approached us. I didn't approach you very anyway. and I, Your demeanor right I now, your, so your arms crossed, and I, like I, I asked I, you a question. I'm just trying to be civil and ask ask you a question about the tent, and you won't react, you won't answer. Number one, you made false allegations in your question, and so I, I don't you, answer questions. It's not an allegation. Like yeah, you are. I, I asked you a question. I you said, made a do presumption you... that the tent on my car is illegal. Oh, it's absolutely which you illegal. Don't know. It's absolutely illegal. What is this? Uh, I'm looking. I'm thinking maybe 10 percent right here. I know. I think uh, Colorado. It's Colorado is like 25% is legal. So this is absolutely illegal tent. So that's for sure. We just like again, we'll have to disagree. <laughs> I mean, sir, if you're a judge, you should. If you're the municipal judge of Elizabeth, you should know what illegal tent is and what it's not, right? You're 100% correct. Yeah. Clear. But you don't. Judge knew what was going on here. He wasn't about to give him any more content, so he just ignores him for the remainder of the time until they're called back inside for their regular duties. So you did a fairly decent job, Judge. Just ignore him, and he eventually went away.